Lovely Rathmullen House. It's sad for me to think of it gone out of the family with all its memories and I do not know yet what will become of it. These were the words of Gerard Otway Bat in 1939 after he had sold Rathmullen House for the sum of £2,000. Gerard Bat was the last surviving member of the Bat family who had lived in this house for 101 years. From 1853, his parents, Thomas and Charlotte Batt, had raised a family of 12 children here, nine sons and three daughters. We can only imagine what it was like for a large family like that, rolling in the lawns and playing in the nursery. Later, as the children grew up, it would be the setting for balls and parties, particularly when the naval ships were anchored in Rathmullen. The years after 1939, the house was quite spartan, as it was occupied by the Irish Army and the Holiday Fellowship. But with the purchase of the house by the Wheeler family in 1961, it was lovingly restored to a very beautiful manor house. As you walk through the rooms, you can feel the ambience of a bygone era. No wonder the house is so popular today with wedding parties, sipping champagne on the lawns. This is a house with a 200 year old history, but it's also a house with a cast of fascinating characters. It can be quite amazing to walk through this house and realise that while the buildings remained the same, the people that lived here were simply passing players. And the history of the house very much mirrors the history of Rathmullen itself. From the Knox family of the Abbey, true to the Bath landlords, and today a modern hotel reflecting Rathmullen as a premier tourist destination.